an entire episode to cater around making sure our girls, Tierra and Shni's posteriors, their rears, their booty cheeks are safe and comfortable and not rigid from the trolleys, the wagons. What are we doing? What are we doing with this show? And the saddest thing is, y'all keep watching it. What is so special about this show that you guys keep watching this more than some of the other weekly shows? I just don't see. Maybe it's Tira. Maybe it's Shni showing a little bit of thigh. Is it just fan service? Is the story gonna get great? I'm not sure. We're like near the end of the season, right? This is like episode eight. So we're pretty much like two thirds of the way in. And now we're meeting, you know, our support character who should be on his deathbed. He seems pretty good. Hopefully there's an enticing arc with this one. Let's begin today's reaction. Yo, Arjitono. ジラート。ジラート。ジラート。ジラート。ジラート。ジラート。ジラート。ジラート。ジラート。ジラート。ジラート。ジラート。ジラート。ジラート。ジラート。ジラート。ジラート。ジラート。ジラート。ジラート。
back at Moon Sanctum. No, 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 Wolf King is the Beast King guy, and he has a daughter. What am I talking about? A turtle and an elephant. They are, they do age really long in the actual real world. This is a fucking nation of boomers, man. ウォルフガングは当事者として優秀って聞いたから。<笑> Elephant and turtle was ready for this. Because this is how he wants to go out. This is his way. Oh my god, it's getting so emotional, dude. The soundtrack is carrying. Because you're a video game character. Okay. Let's see if his fangs will reach him. They're really setting the stage. Oh there's no way Shin's gonna be nice about this, right? There, there, there's no way Shin's gonna be nice about this because I feel like, um, like, like sometimes. Like, in this situation, should you, like, uh, be nice and try to be weak and let his fangs reach him? Or should you go all out no matter what? Like, we should one-shot him out of respect, right? Like, never, what's it called? Judo flip? Ju judo meme never, uh, always give it your all. Give it your all. Hold up, hold up. I think there's a... <laughs> this. Right? Out of sheer respect for your opponent. Because if you were to go easy, you're disrespecting everything that your enemy has put into for the fight. So I feel like out of respect for Gerard, we need to fucking just one-shot him and let him just die in front of his followers, you know? I, I don't know, may maybe I'm mean, but you know, that's respect in itself. <laughs> I gotta kill my best friend soon. Oh my. <laughs> One week pass, or are we not gonna have the duel tonight? Sorry, today's episode. No voice acting, but soundtrack? Montage time. Let's pass the week really quickly. Moon Sanctum. Make better gauntlets. Blacksmithing, wow! This is on the same level of how fraudulent Asna's cooking was in SAO, bro. No, Elizabeth. Elizabeth is a better example. She did the same shit too when she made the piece of shit, bro. Fuck, fucking brought the dragon dookie, bro. It just fucking gets made because it's a video game. Oh, the Moon Sanctum is going to be a little bit of 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 I don't know what his IRL is like. I don't know if his life is better IRL or here. Okay. He's gonna leave all... He's gonna leave everyone behind. Did Shini hear this? Can we do something about this though? She has bullshit powers. 
No shot, we're gonna actually kill so hard, right? ダナ。調子はどうだ。一瞬で燃えるぞ。心身ともに。私たちはここで待機しております。もし流れ弾が飛んできたら存分に戦ってきてください。分かった。さあ、ティアラ。新幹線。うう。うう。初代の教えは生
piano theme playing. Piano theme playing. That's never a good sign during moments like this. This is actually hidden, bro. What the fuck? Yo. Newgate, this episode is the best episode so far. Holy shit. Some... It, the soundtracks has been absolutely on point. Something about an old friend that's been waiting 500 years so that he can finally challenge a duel with the best friend before he dies. And then the peak soundtracks, like, goddamn, it's tugging the heartstrings, man. It's the musical choice, man. Gerard, no! Damn, bro. <laughs> Spare in peace. I'm raising my head! That's right! His fangs reached him! The greatest closure they could have. My man was smiling before he died! What are the odds, bro? Oh, they all have beast forms. <laughs> Even transforming into beast because of the beast nation to give one last howl for our lord, man. No furry jokes. No furry jokes. Oh. Holy fuck. I didn't realize Newgate could do this. I, 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 I actually didn't think Newgate could like have an episode like this. I thought we were just like doing random bullshit shenanigans every episode, but like today's episode was like solid. Oh my god. <laughs> what is the point of that camera, man? Like we, we I, I, of all the things you could have shot, you're like, you know what? Y'all, it's been a sad episode, right guys? Kind of sad this entire time. All right, schnee feet. Here's some schnee toes, guys. Here you go. Yeah, back home and leave you here, Shni. <laughs> yeah, but still it's sad. Stop! Stop! You, you can't try to make an audience get immersed into the heartfelt story of Gerard and, sh you know, shit and do this shit, bro. Come on. Have some shame, cameraman. Know your time and place. Come on, bro! Whoa! Crying emoji from Blue Archive! And that was today's New Gate episode. Without a doubt, my favorite episode. This is the best episode. I didn't realize that a show like this would seem to be just a cheap isekai that's just doing nonchalant things, fan service here and there, and just having a goofy time, which I consider just mid overall, was able to deliver such an impactful story between two brothers, man. Best friends from the past, he's been waiting, and his one regret was, can my fangs reach Shin? And it did! But just as he was about to get the finishing blow, his lifespan pretty much worn out. And then the soundtracks used, like, the musical direction of this episode, it was actually fucking peak. Today's episode was absolutely great. And I just wish that every other episode could deliver this much, you know, emotional impact or something like this, man. Because, like, last episode compared to this, it's like night and day, right? Like, goddamn, this was an absolutely great one. And moving forward, I guess we have 9, 10, 11, and 12. Four more episodes, which is going to cover a different dark. I doubt we're going to stay here any longer. So, wonder what that's going to be about. But that's it from me. If you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlists for more content. And until next time, take care.